Hey guys, Shady Sock here. I'm back with another video. Sorry about the last video. My um recording program kind of glitched a little bit and made it look a little bit weird. And um, also, I was like five miles away from my microphone. Sorry about that. But we're back here in episode two of um, Five Nights at Freddy's Six. All right, so in episode two, it's gonna be like episode one, but two. So. All right, so now you guys should actually be able to hear me this time, since I lowered the volume a lot. So you should be able to hear me nice and well. Unlike last time, sorry about that. I am a candy cadet. Come get your candy here. If you're starting candy all day. the series Every on the day. second episode, candy. don't watch the first candy. one. Unless if you want to be tortured, it sounds bad. Return to Candy Cadet yeah, again, kidding me. and maybe I will tell you a story. He gave me the literal worst, like, points that I can get from Candy Cadet. But yeah, we're just gonna farm Candy Cadet I since he's candy. the best item right now. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Maybe if we get lucky, we'll hear a story. Return to Candy Cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. Nice. No story, but guy yeah, around. Alright, let's play again. Candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Return right, to nice. Candy cadet it's giving us again. Pretty fair. I will tell you a story. <laughs> Alright, um, let's keep playing Candy Cadet, since he's the best. I am a Candy Cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day. He's candy all day. day. Candy, candy, candy. I wonder what type of candy it is. Like, honestly, what is it? I will tell you a story. Well, at least he gives us a lot of good stuff. Like, we got that money right now. Alright, we have enough. We're leveling up everybody. We're buying this stuff because Royal Party said it's good. We're gonna buy the stage. We're gonna buy Mr. Hippo. We're not gonna buy Mr. Hippo. Wait, but Mr. Hippo's the best. I guess we'll buy this frog, because eh, why not? We'll buy this, because it's good for atmosphere. If I really want something good for atmosphere, I'd get this, but I really don't like those. Let's see what's in here. Okay. Basics. Alright, now what we're gonna do... Is we're getting this rid of Mr. Candy, we're putting down Happy Frog. And now it's, I'm back to farming candy cadet. I am cadet. candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Nice. Return to candy cadet again, and maybe I will tell you a story. He never tells a story. He's, he's a scammer. Alright, cool, so we're just gonna play some Midnight Motors, because I know you guys just don't want to see Candy Cadet the entire time. I'm so good at this game. I 
we're just the strat here is to stick to the top. The strat is to stick in the middle. Place the ball fit. Nice. So we're gonna go ahead and do this. I'll play this one, even though it's rigged more than Candy Cadet. It's really good. I am a candy cadet. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy. All right, candy. we're gonna wait like a solid minute. We're not gonna wait a minute, but it's gonna take like a minute. Not really. All right, cool. Now I will tell you a story about a young story. Boy who was sealed in a small room. In the room was a furnace, and five keys. She was told that each of the five keys would unlock one of the I literally keys heard this yesterday when I was playing it through. Inside each room was a child that she could take with her as she fled the building. But she was only allowed to leave her own room with one key, not all five. Desperate to find a way to save all five children, the woman melted the five keys together in the furnace to create a single key, hoping it would unlock all five She must have been blonde. Of course. It did not work that way. Now her key opened none of the doors. Rather than leaving her room with a key to one life, she had taken with her the key to five deaths. Nice. Six thousand! Nice! Alright, so that was pretty good. That's why Candy Kid is really good. Give that shutter. Alright, now we can, um... Nice, plus one ref. Alright, cool. So we're doing pretty good. Alright, we're gonna play Candy Cadet again, even though I know he's not gonna tell me a story. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day, every day. Candy, candy, candy. Alright, we're gonna do the same strat, because it seemed to work last time. This music kind of bopping, though. Turn to Candy Cadet again. The strat didn't I work. Tell you a story. Game win. Nice. Alright, come on. We're gonna I spam it as soon as we can. Come get your candy here. I have candy all day. Every That's day. the new strat. Candy. 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 Now I will tell you a story he, about Oh my god, it worked. Boy. He had a red snake that he kept in a metal cage, whose hunger could not be satisfied. One day, the boy found five baby kittens outside his house. He brought them inside and kept them in a shoe box. He knew that the snake might kill them, but could not bring himself to get rid of the snake. He knew that if he chose one kitten to feed to the snake, it might be satisfied, but he could not choose. So, he went to bed, leaving the cage open. 
The snake went to the shoebox, chose a kitten at random, and ate it. After five nights had gone by, the boy was full of regret, and cut snake open. He pieced the remains together, and put the kitten back into the shoebox. What the hell? <laughs> did he bury the box with the dead kitten, or did he... Like, keep it? Alright, well we can buy some stuff, so let's do this. Buy some thing is just like... We want... Oh, these things are good for the price. I want health and safety. Really bad. Oh, these are good too, though. But, no. Oh, this thing's so good. I just can't pass it up. And with the remaining $100. I know I could save money for like the night, but I'm not gonna. Alright, cool, we're finished. Nice. So this episode's going along well. Alright, here we go. Oh, almost forgot to motion detect. Can never be too sure. Even though, as you know, if you watch the last episode, please don't watch it if you're watching this one. Um, we did not do the Molten Freddy Salvage. Marty Plumbers! Plungers, my bad. Not plumbers. Alright. I thought I just heard something, but it was just me bumping my microphone. Alright, so, let's see some the scariest thing in this game. So, we look over here, we see this Foxy poster. That is scary. Hey, this is how my printer sounds. Center. Oh well. I don't know how to fix that. I'll try to figure it out someday though. See, um, it looks like I'm hovering over replacing bulbs right now. But um, in the actual game, I'm just like on the gray thing. Now I'm hovering over replacing bul bulbs and it's just like, you know, over here somewhere. Alright, cool, we get to log off after I do this. Alright, cool, now I know the prices so I can save money. Now, I'm thinking about doing this. Is it again? Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. Alright, animatronic found the in the back alley. Let's see. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it. Alright, um. Or if you choose to. Jimmy Neutron Trap. I'm not gonna do him. So we're just gonna throw him back in the alley. 
Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in mm, one place. I don't know if I want them all to be in one place. Alright, let's see what we did. Nice, alright, well, um, that's it for this episode, um, subscribe, drop a like, whatever, um, see you guys next time, bye.